Hi, I'm Paul from PDH Sports, leading online racket specialist, and today I've been given this great opportunity to play test three different strings from Ashaway. We've got the uh, multi nick uh, in a 1.15 string, we've got the ultra nick, which is a 1.25 string, and the super nick ZX, which is also in a 1.25. Uh, gauge. All, all rackets are strung up identically in the same racket, so it's the Powerkill uh, 130ZX. Yeah, I'm going to try and give my feedback on how the strings perform. If you're like me, you know, I like to really try and dial in my racket. Um, I've tried various different strings. I know what tension I like. Um, so I'm going to find that, you know, this is going to be really interesting for me because these are three strings that I currently don't use. Um, and I'm quite interested to find out how they perform. Okay, so this is the uh, Ultranic, again 1.25 gauge, um, they also do it in a slightly thinner gauge, uh, but the one for the playtest today is this. This one doesn't come with such a, a, a wear layer as Ashaway put it. If you're really heavy on your strings, it may be that you're not going to get quite the sort of longevity on this, but um, yeah, let's see how this one plays also. So, trying to put the... Uh, Alternate through paces for power. Yeah. First impressions, it's a lovely feel. Very, uh, any way I can describe this is quite an airy feel. So, very clean, light, no vibration at all off the strings, just, just all. Uh, coming. Getting a lot of power, but it's quite a soft feel to it. So I think the softness of the string um, relays feel. But I would say it's coming off pretty powerfully as well. I just miss hit one there. This is like miss hit and it was a little bit dead, but certainly uh, good fit, good power I would say. Lots of grab on the ball. Again, I described it with the power, but it's just such a uh, clean feel off the string. Um, very smooth. Keep using the word airy, but it's like it's just uh, feels really light. And you know, one thing when you're taking the ball in short, you want to you want that consistency. And uh, I'd say with this string, that's what you're going to get. You're getting the same consistent light feel on all of your shots. The Multinic uh, 115 is a new string that's coming out in uh, around March time, I believe. Um, so this is a slightly different take for Ashaway because it comes with a polyurethane coating to, to give it a little bit more of a sort of like a, a shiny finish, very similar to um, a Technifiber style string. So it's still the multi-filament, but um, it's been coated to give a little bit more longevity, I think, to the string because it's quite thin. Okay, so let's get on court uh, and see how it plays. And a little bit harder off the strings than the other two. So you can, uh, I think because it's slightly thinner gauge, you can feel a little bit more uh, of the word bite, a little bit more bite off the strings. Um, but it's definitely a harder hit. Uh, this is the thinnest string that I've used today. And certainly now as I'm taking this ball in, I think I can tell it's just gripping the, gripping the, uh, the ball in lovely. So,
Again, like the other two strings, you know, the one thing you're probably paying for from these sort of premium strings is, it's just that consistency. You're getting a nice, same feeling. And that really helps for you to build your confidence uh, on your short game. So, so this racket is the Supernic ZX. So again, it's a multi-filament string, quite a sort of rough textured string. This one again, you know, it's got a little bit, it's got like a, a wear uh, layer on it to sort of help with um, the longevity of the string. So if you're a little bit more of a heavier, um, user on the strings, then then this this can help. Let's go and see how this one plays. So, see, it's feeling not too dissimilar to the other rackets. Again, good power, slightly softer than the Multinic. Not as airy and smooth as the Ultranic, but all in all, pretty solid. No issues there again um, with the, the power I'm getting back off, off the strings. It's a little bit more, it's a word, I used air on the other one, but like a little bit more tinny, but not in a bad way. Uh, it's slightly harder than the, slightly harder feel, just a little bit, which I think uh, relays back with the feel to my hands. So getting nice, uh, nice feedback on my short stuff. And again, the thing that I'm looking for is that consistency, you know, coming off the racket the same each time. So um, in conclusion there, um, I found that sometimes when I have, do reviews like this, it, it can be quite difficult because there wasn't massive differences between any of the rackets there that I tried, but very small, subtle differences. So the new string, the Multinic, uh, you know, I found was, was really good for, probably excelled the most on the short stuff. Uh, could have been because it's a slightly thinner gauge. Um, it's very, it'd be interesting to see how it goes for its longevity. Obviously the idea with this sort of polyurethane coating um, to give it that wear layer that uh, Ashaway talked to me about. Um, but performance, overall power, and taking it in is, you know, exactly what I'd expect from an Ashway string. Um, these two, so the, uh, the Supernic ZX and the Ultranic, um, not masses of difference. Um, myself, I preferred the Ultranic because the airy light feel that I seem to get from it. Um, but again, if I felt I was going through the string too quickly, then it would be no problem for me to swap onto the Supernic ZX with the view that maybe this is gonna last me a little bit longer because I didn't, in all honesty, feel masses of difference. I just felt that um, if, I had, if I had complete choice, then for me, the Ultranic performed better. The Multinic is really probably targeted to tr maybe take a little bit of Technifibers business. It's got that more of a shiny finish. A um, little bit more of an explosive feel, uh, and it's a, it's a, you know it's a new take on sort of an Ashway string that uh, people that have used Ashway before might not be used to. You know, if you're looking to upgrade your racket, whatever the brand of racket, um, you know the strings make such a massive difference. You know, I wouldn't dream of like um, playing with just sort of the basic string. Uh, you know, you've got to think about considering uh, upgrading your strings. And uh, these three strings from Ashaway would be something that um, you know, we would highly recommend here at PDH Sports. For more information, uh, these, all these strings are going to be on our website. If you, you know, like the video, feel free to put your comments below and uh, don't forget to subscribe.